Sigoli Swagweg, Derek Nguyen-Gets. Hello everyone, I'm Derek Montroy. We're here today to get an inside look at the United Indian Nations Watta Maple Farm. Watta means maple in the Oneida language, and maple is still an important part of Oneida and Haudenosaunee culture. To the Haudenosaunee people, the maple is the first tree to awaken each spring, and when the sap flows, it means spring is near, even when snow is on the ground. The sap from the maple is considered a medicinal gift from the Creator. This gift served not only as a food source, but also as a boost to the spirit, as it was a sure sign that spring was coming. And maple leaves, through their changing colors and eventual fall, let us know when the cycle is to begin again. Water is the essential element that moves the cycle. We give thanks for this special gift of maple sugar and the waters that give us life. It is our belief that we do not inherit the earth from our ancestors, rather we borrow it from our children. So sustainability is paramount in the process we use, both from our forestry management standards to our insistence on quality over quantity. We use environmentally friendly practices throughout the entire production from sap collection to sugaring to bottling. We've limited production to one tap per tree, less than 30 inches in diameter. While this is better for the tree, the yield is less than a large scale maple producer using traditional tapping standards. It's a practice that honors the forest and honors tradition. With this tree being almost 300 years old, it's quite possible that this tree could have been tapped by Oneida ancestors. With more episodes to follow in this video series, check out how the United Indian Nation is keeping its commitment to the seventh generation and its maple harvesting practices.